Hassan can get the gate. Another truffle hunt? No, we're meeting Eldrin. The old elf I told you about. I spent summers here. Tended hollow when I was a kid. Hard to imagine the mighty hunter hanging out with deer. Not everything in the forest. Hassan, hang back. Eldrin, I got your message. Oh? Who are you? It's me, Davrin. I knew a Davrin once. Strange kid. Too small, even for an elf. Well, now, hold on. So, this walking mountain of armor I see before me can't be him. <laughs> you sure got old and cranky. You got old and far too good looking. I was always the lady killer. This is Rook. We're working together. And can you be trusted around our holler, Rook? I'd be honored for the chance to earn their trust. The holler decide that. And if you don't impress them, their antlers let you know. Arlathan Forest is wrong in a way I've never seen. We know. The holler aren't coming around. And these old bones aren't up to the task of chasing them anymore. I'm worried they're sick. I need you to check on them for me. Hassan, I told you. Is that what I think it is? I'm looking after him. Remarkable. A griffin. Never thought I'd see one. Maybe all those summers here rubbed off. The monster hunter turned shepherd. What was Davrin like back then? We don't need to waste Eldrin's time with- He sang a lot. This guy? He'd sing to the holler. You mean the Grey Warden standing next to me? Now hold on. I'd get tired trying to herd them. I started humming to keep myself awake, and they slowed down to listen. <laughs> so naturally you broke out into song. Only when humming didn't work. Just getting the job done. And now the job is caretaker to a griffin. Davrin's got a soft spot in there. Hassan's digging it out. Just keeping his nose clean. Seems my old lesson sunk in. Not every creature in the forest is quarry. I didn't ignore everything you said. And now we've got some hollow to find. Davrin. I'm glad to see you took the road less traveled. It suits you. Okay, what do we do? Find some stone root, a marble tree, and banner berries. I thought we were looking for Hala. A lot of people would go chasing after them, running around, getting nowhere. Hala can keep that up for days. Maybe you could sing to them. I'll go right on pretending you didn't say that. Trick I've learned. Ringing the dinner bell's a lot easier than searching the whole damned forest. Here we go. Found a marple tree. See if it has a dead branch. Got it. It's hollow, right? When you blow through it, it mimics a hollow's call. The dinner bell. Not ringing it yet, but that's the idea. Here, some banner berries. Sweet as candy. Hollow lapped them up. Interesting. I wonder what they taste like. Don't even think it. Uncle Eldrin let me try one once as a lesson. It lasted an hour. Paralysis, hallucinations, cramps. Ah. Uh. Uh-huh. Great for Hala. Bad for people. Over here, stone root. Dig up. Good. Hang on to that. 
We slice away the outer husk. There's seeds inside that mimic the hollow mating scent. I thought we were ringing the dinner bell. Maybe it's a romantic dinner. Time to get out that marble branch and call the holla. He sounds excited. Let's hope it's that and not I'm hungry for venison. It's on the other side of this. He senses something. Could be Hala. We've got a griffin. Hassan could track them. I need to be careful of the predator in him that's ingrained to hunt and kill things before they kill him. He'd attack the Hala? Probably not. But he's never seen one. This is a good spot. Lay out the stone root and banner berries. Time to blow the horn. I'll let you have the honor. Sick. How long can it last like that? Another week, maybe? The forest is going rotten. We need to do something. Look around for more Vanterberries. Asan, don't you even think about going after- Devrin, remember. Trust. Right. Turlum. Okay. Asan, do as I would do, boy. Be nice. Did Asan just bring it some food? He did. I'll be damned. Won't forget that anytime soon. Thanks for helping out. Something new every day. She could always be like this. There's more to him than hunting Darkspawn. Eyes of an eagle, roar of a lion. But maybe the heart of a holler. And the appetite of all three? You found your talent. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Come on, boy. You did good. We'll need to tell Aldrin about this Hala. So your uncle is quite the character. Aldrin will drink you under the table, then the floor, then bury you in the basement as a joke. Most of my clan didn't understand why I left. Eldrin had an open mind, saw I was restless. He approved. He knew I had to find my own way, though he warned me about joining the Wardens. Too dangerous. Too much darkness. Eldrin always preached balance in life. Not something Grey Wardens seem to know much about. We reek of darkspawn all the time. I guess that's why working with Hassan, there's something to be said for drawing strength from the light.
Any luck? We found one. Looked sick. I was afraid of that. If you can find more Vanna berries... Hassan took care of it. A griffin helped to holler? It's like he was a shepherd. I couldn't believe it. Remarkable. Nothing about that in the training manual. The world knows griffins as warriors who fought dark spawn, but they existed long before that. Existed as what? A creature of the wild, free to explore their nature. But griffins live for the hunt. So do you. Yet now, you're a caretaker. I'm proof that anything can change. Don't know if it's for the better. Nothing about change is ever certain. I once knew a restless young elf who believed there was more to life than shoveling hollow manure. It's the nature of nature to surprise us. Maybe you're right. See you around, Eldrin. You grew up among humans, right? Do you believe in the Maker? Come to think of it, I don't know anymore. But I don't think an indifferent god is better than an evil one. So, oh, you and Rook? Nice. I've got the feeling I missed something. Adari. I can smell it. Well, that's... on both of you. Oh, really? Well, that's interesting. a strange thing, Emmerich. It's simply not true that Manfred's doing my laundry. He's got tangled in a bedsheet, and Tash mistook that for... Uh... Not that. I heard you're preparing for some big necromancy rite. How did you know? <laughs> you talk out loud to yourself a lot, Emmerich. Ah, oh dear. The rite is a difficult, delicate thing. I promise to explain it if I succeed. I get you. Good luck. <laughs> 